Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of this game. We just came back from a successful mission, we gotta level up. Um, I have $569, that should be enough to purchase a new companion, if <laughs> you know what I mean. I'm talking about prostitution, which is legal in space. Um, anyway, abilities. What are we doing? What are we doing? See, I didn't have a, I haven't had a chance yet to just look at these things. Whenever you damage a target, your damage increases by 3% until the end of your turn. This effect can stack up to 100%. Okay, so we have... Oh, wait, he has zero points unassigned, I think. Zero ability points. Uh, right, okay, Isaac has one. We could try respecking, but, like, I guess I don't want to do that. Um, so rank three of this would give me more dodge, more evade. No, 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 because I'm using heavy armor, so it would give me extra reduced, extra 5% reduced damage taken, extra 5% health. And if I'm critically hit, I heal 25% of damage on your turn. That seems pretty cool. I don't really like the idea of getting down... Activate Aegis mode to automatically attack when enemies take action, inflicting 50% weapon damage with 200% bonus threat. Last until your next turn. Maximum of 3 attacks. Base malfunction chance of 20%. See, that seems really cool. Um, I do want to get there. So, I mean, I, th I think we just take the... I like this, uh, this tank build, uh, where he's kind of the... If he's going to tank the hits, then I want him to be able to tank the hits, you know? Uh, let's go to hire new crawlers. I want to do. I want a. Um, I want a void psyker. And maybe we'll get a get a girl void psyker, and her name will be. Uh. Uh. I don't have a good. I don't have a good joke here. Cause like, what are these guys? They're like crazy, crazy voodoo people. Oh, okay. I have to do another guy, but it's. No, it's um. How do you spell that? Dr. Fassier? Yeah, I think that's it. Okay, on view abilities. I don't know... Summoner. Okay, hold on. We're, we're gonna... I'm not gonna worry about that. We're just gonna hire. Because I do want a Void Psyker. Maybe... Um, we do have enough to hire another character. Which might be a good idea. How many people can we take on a in a in a group? Okay, you start out at level three. Let's go to your abilities. Um, deal 100% weapon damage. Attempt to drain two to three shields, gaining void energy for each shield drained. Void energy is consumed to power your abilities. High levels can increase the odds of a deadly overload. Consume 30 void energy and attempt to seize control of the target to charm them for one turn. Seems good. When you gain void energy, you also gain Psi Weapon. Psy weapon boosts your critical hit chance and the damage of your next strike or shoot by 5.5% for each point of void energy gained for one turn. Siphon life. You heal 3% of your max health and gain 5 void energy. Consume 20 void energy to deal 50% weapon damage and eat 1 to 2 buffs off of the target. That seems pretty cool, actually. T 
do you so like if they buff themselves are you consuming their buff so you're removing their buff yeah okay that's neat dark majesty your next manipulation ability affects all enemies and also deals 100% bonus weapon damage dang Rank 3 manipulation abilities consume zero void energy while Dark Majesty is active. Okay. Uh, Evoker. Is this 5 void energy? Blast the target, Shadow. So this is just damage. Shadow Bolt becomes Void Bolt, deal 100% weapon damage and gain 10 energy. So ignite, consume 10 void energy for each shield on the target, destroying the shields and dealing 30% weapon damage per shield and 1% weapon damage for each point of stored void energy. This guy seems good against shields. Um, consume all void energy to unleash a violent storm. Psychically link the target, dealing 20% weapon damage each turn for 5 turns and gaining 5 void energy when backlash deals damage. If you overload while backlash is active, what is overload? Overview. Info log. I don't know, man. Abilities. Okay, let's let's check out this last one. Increase the maximum amount of void energy you can store. Do you keep your void energy through? Um, Call shadows to attack through con through different combats, or do you build it up each time? Call shadows to attack three times for each target. Each attack deals 10% weapon damage and generates 1 to 2 void energy. So 30 void energy to bind a horror to the target. Uh, horror deals 30% weapon damage and leaps to a random target. When you critically hit, misery strikes a random target for 30% of the damage. Consume 100% of your void energy to curse all targets with miasma, dealing 1% weapon damage every turn for each point of energy use. When you gain void energy, void energy there's 30% chance, chance to open a portal to somewhere. If a portal opens, a nasty thing slips through and attacks a random en enemy for 20%. Uh, rank 3. Nasty things sometimes stick around. That seems pretty funny. Consume 40 void energy to summon the tentacle of a lesser monstrosity to attack the target for 3 turns. Consume all void energy to something summon something Mavalin. You shouldn't use this ability. Okay, so here's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking... Because this one seems like... Uh, I think we go Evoker, and then... There's some tactical usage in Manipulator, and um, kind of some... Like a lot of expenditure in in summoner, so we're gonna go try and go with uh, with evoker, and then work on some of these summoner things, because this this doesn't actually consume energy. So okay, I'm gonna take this, take three points of that. I'm going to take. Oh, 40% weapon damage per shield. Oh my gosh. Okay, I am gonna... We're gonna keep buffing the passive, because passives are good. I like passives. Each point of void energy added by Chaotic Gathering heals you for 0.5 of your max health. See, that seems really good at level 3. Gotta get those level 3 ones. 
Shadow Bolt and Void Bolt pierce shields and void resistance to burn the very soul of your foe. Okay, cool. I like it. Um, if I have anything rusty down, you're using a light melee weapon. Here, have this light shield. That's like just a straight upgrade, I think. Can I not wear that? Uncommon light shield. Oh no, I did equip that. 8 damage, 3 charges. 325 TU time unit regen. Yeah, okay, so that's the, the basically the same. Um, I need the Void Psyker's Ominous Crystal Ritual Candle and Essence. Where's my autocraft bench? Requi requires a prototype chip, prototypes chip blueprint. Okay, hold on. We need to take these stolen goods and sell them to the black market. I have something to auction. Oh man, they're hostile, or they will be. 55 credits and 4 rep with Titan Metallurgy. Oh, these guys give me a, a clob, though. I think we're going the the most credits that we can. And Chimera, I don't like Chimera. We'll sell this to uh MRLT. All right, so selling them to corporations affects your reputation, but you get more money. Uh, that's cool, all right. So, I think, what else we got? Info, loadout. I'd like to buy some more med kits, but maybe I won't need to do that as much. Heavy shield. So, shift click, I don't know, okay, 19, 5 charges, is that this shield right here? No, they're both, both basically the same though. Less damage. Okay, so I, I, I don't really want that. Can we buy med kits here? Buy a couple med kits. I'm assuming the Void Psyker is a human. Void Psyker's Boom Sling Light Armor. Okay, hold on. Take Dr. Fassier. So that's a that's not an upgrade. I don't even know if I'll ever want to use a gun on my Void Psyker if I'm just gonna be using abilities. I guess it's just a stat stick, right? Five hundred dollars for an auto cipher. Most terminals, maglock doors, and safes. Bypass most of them. I don't think we have stuff for that. I think we're 
We only have $300. I don't think I'm gonna... I think we'll just wait. Wait, wait. What do you have for sale? I'll just sell... I'm gonna sell this gun. Sell this gun. Sell this trash shield, and sell this trash shield. I need a prototypes chip blueprint. Okay. Um, all right, I think we'll be fine. I think we're good. Let's check the board for work. This one has... That's a cakewalk. Aurora Starliners wants intel on what happened to Stella Marine since you uncovered the coordinates. Oh, that's the quest. That's the main quest. I gotcha. I'd like you to retrieve a black box from the nav bay located on deck 105. Yeah, alright. Let's do it. I'm ready. Team select. Nice. Welcome to the picturesque, picturesque Stella Marine, I guess. This is deck 110, according to the directions from Aurora. You want to head over to the commercial plaza and an elevator ride down to 105 for the nearest nav chamber and a black box. Easy as pie. Got two calls waiting for you from Horizon Robotics and Workers United. For a hush-hush mission, there's a lot of people up in our business. Not so surprising, secrets make good merchandise when scandals afoot. What do they want? Both are proposing a quick job while you're already on board. Decent pay offered. Who would you like to talk to first? Got any details about the employers? Horizon Robotics is one of the UP, UFP fat cats, rich as Crozius too. Workers United is a civ group protecting the rights of greasers and such. Which do you want to talk to first? Connect me to Workers United. Nuanced and charismatic voice like an old world politician. Apparently she's not big on hollow chat. Hello there, I recommend, represent Workers United. We're a civilian group focused on protecting the rights of individuals. Before we continue, I feel I should make you aware of the fact that your reputation precedes you. How so? Word reached me from the Bright Hall Colony that your team completed delivery of vital medical supplies that Chimera was falsely claiming were unpaid for. On behalf of Bright Hall and oppressed workers everywhere, thank you. Glad to have been of help. What assistance were you looking for today? Simply put, we require the black box data you've been hired to obtain. We want the raw data, not whatever's left over after a cor corporation PR finishes their hatchet job. Forward us a copy before handing it over and we'll repay the favor with 100 credits. Oh. I'm under contract with another party. A deal's a deal. Keep in mind that you'd be doing a great service to families of the missing, missing colonists. Don't you think they deserve to know the truth? Maybe, but it's not my responsibility to give them... Alright. We'll see about that. I don't want to be too goody-goody here, otherwise we won't get anything done. I want money, you know. Hollow display darkens momentarily, then flickers back on, revealing a flash-looking corporation mouthpiece. An oily grin, you can almost taste the insincere winks about to be directed your way. Hey there, partner! My employer has a little favor to ask. Aurora is determined to get their hands on that black box, but the intel really ought to be going to Horizon first. Um, as the unofficial UFP leader, we have a responsibility to make sure all evidence is handled property. properly. Sounds like something you should take up with Aurora. Or, sounds reasonable. Yeah, sure. How much money you got? Uh, favors me with a jocular wink. Righto! All we'll need you to do is fire at the black box and send a copy of the log data our way. After you find it, that lovely pilot of yours has the drop codes already. You can still take the box to Aurora afterwards and they'll be none the wiser. Uh, said transmitting the data might cause corruption. Sounds like a scare tactic. Those boxes are made to withstand just about anything. Send the data our way. You'll be 300 credits richer, and no one will need ever need no except the two of us. Sound no dice. I'm on a job, and I complete intend to complete it. The Horizon rep gives you a wide smile, but his gaze is flat and reptilian. Let's not be hasty, friend. Getting on the wrong side of Horizon Robotics is not the way for a new crawler to get started in this biz. Think on that while you're wandering around. I think we can probably kill whatever you send at us. When you get to that box, I'm sure you'll make the right decision. 300 credits for a simple transmission. He 
Human agendas, conflicting goals may collide. More risk, more reward. Let's find this black box and get paid. All right. Well, what is that? I'm not sure what that is. Oh, all right. It was like spooky. Spooky in there. All right, so this is the Starliner that's like crashed and some mysterious circumstances. Why does the human rights group need the, uh, I guess the family's right, okay. Your family was viciously ripped apart by aliens. Sorry, that sucks. Give me your money. I mean, 300 credits is not a lot. Considering, uh, it's a sleazy corporation. They have to be, they gotta be... I think I'll let them try and bribe me a little bit more for that kind of thing. What do we got here? Can't go over here or pick up any of that. You emerge into the wide, inviting halls of a posh residential area. The upper deck decks clearly house the affluent passengers. A waiter bot is idly nearby and turns you as you enter, waving an oddly cheering greeting. Hello, Mr. Robot. Come whisper us your secrets. Oh, he's... he's pissed. Combat has begun with waiter bot. He slap, slapped Isaac for 12 damage. Why are we killing this waiter bot? Okay, we have zero void energy. We can strike. Deal damage and gain 15 void energy, yeah. So that's like what we use until we get 30, at least. I missed. Good. Great start. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Damn it. That's just not a very accurate attack, is it? This poor waiter bot, man. That's a really cool effect. Team stares in stunned silence at the downed bot. Not an aggressor. Behavior does not compute. Data corruption? An unworthy foe, yet an unexpected one. Call Luna and report the attack. You love chatting with me, don't you? What's up? Combat mode engaged with a domestic robot. Need increased credits. Service in this place is terrible. <laughs> uh, get the wire to Aurora. I wouldn't mind if they tossed a little extra hazard pay our way. Hazards lurk behind every potted plant. Not on the shuttle, though. Depends on your definition of a hazard. Your impending demise is my unimpending, impending unemployment. Just looking out for you, what's best to the team. We'll watch for more hostiles. All right. Yeah, okay. There's going to be enemies in this video game. Got it. No way. Would have never guessed. Look at this fancy plant stuff. What's going on here? There's the cred sticks. I was, like, I was just about to say, where's all my cred sticks at? Give me that fat loot. I ain't here for free. Got the money, honey. We've got your disease. But I need the money, honey. What is this? It's just a thing. More Java. Fashion magazine. 30 days abs. Yes, please. It says days, so. Ooh, boom slang Tommy gun. Person of the year is definitely not you. Wow. Rude. Maybe it is me. What if it is? Is it me? Oh, whoa, whoa, what is this guy? A figure emerges clumsily from behind a bulkhead, waving his hands to get your attention. Logos on his suit indicate that he works for the Dablu Yutaki Corporation. Okay. Don't shoot me, I'm not armed. I'm just glad one, you're not one of those psychotic waiter bots. Replace your meat suit. Upgrade to immortal steel. Sooner the better. 
Uh, right. Listen, I'm in a real bind and you look capable. Maybe you could help me out. There's easy credits in it for you. Hold up, the Stella Marine is supposed to be on lockdown. What are you doing here? Well, respectfully, what are you doing here? I think we both know that the corporations all play by their own rules. I'm just trying to capitalize on their interests, same as you. Plus, when du the Blue Yuktai says jump, you don't ask why. About those credits. Right, the Blue Yuktai sent me in here to locate a former employee's residence. They have an intel that he was recruiting for Workers United, and they want to get their hands on a copy of his, re his recruitment records. I was ex expecting an empty ship, but I've been running from domestic since I walked in. I'm not geared for this, but if you can locate the records and wire me a copy, I'll pay 50 credits for each file. Tell me more about Workers United. Just some low-budget civvy group, typical knuckle-dragging jackboot types from what I understand. Normally, W. Yuktai would ignore them, but lately have been they've been causing delays at some of the manufacturers. Uh, D.Y. wants to locate the leaders and nip the problem in the bud before it gets out of hand. Uh, deal. Comlink address. Guy's residence was in this wing. His name is Herman or Harvey or something like that. Okay. Okay. I don't know if 10 per file is enough to make me care. He's got the money though, honey. Maybe we do have his disease. Oh, it's dark in here. Oh, sick. I want it I want space to be a thing so that we can that is a toilet. Oh, dude, there's a cred stick in the toilet. Hell yeah. I want space to be a thing so that we can have crazy hologram. That is soap. These are nice digs. This is like a hotel room quality. Look at this. Oh, that's so nice. Hologram, like, jungle wall. It's so cool. Old data chip. Is that mold? <laughs> Plop gun charm. Common accessory. It's cute? I guess. Oh, I hear it. Oh! No! Run! Now we can take him. Okay, so you do start out with zero void energy, so I think this character is better on, like, multiple targets. Because then you can build up void energy on one, you know, from one, uh, one enemy and then use it on the second. Man, Isaac is not having a good day here. So hold on, I need... Oh, that requires shields on the target too. So I guess we're just... We don't even have like a... We kind of have the same problem as with Zero. We, we just don't have a skill that expires... Or that expends our void energy yet. He has one health. This is going well. <laughs> so many misses. Come on. Alright, easy experience. Oh, dude, look at this little... It's the bird, the desk bird. It bob bobs in the water. That's so cool. Hello, top computer. Welcome, you user Herman Dorfel. Security lockout engaged. Your session is timed out. Please log in. Submit the entered password. Try something else. No. Okay, leave the holotop alone. We gotta, like, search. General funnel food bar. That is a cat. Pickles! Goes to the vet. His, his password is pickles. Almost guaranteed. Anything in the toilet? Nope. Glad that they uh, they flush in this place, otherwise... What? Cabinet. It's in the cabinet. Do 
dude, I didn't open the cabinet of the other place. It's definitely pickles. Password hint. Hint seven letters. B I C K L E S. Submit the answers. Yeah. Easy. I'm a crazy hacker. Look at that. <laughs> uh, examine the Workers United Manifest. Digital leaflet that Herman is apparently handing out to potential recruits and contains the information about Workers United brief mission statement and a whole lot of political musings and anti corporation rhetoric. Write a wire a copy to the Workers United rep. No payment on that one. Whatever. Payment incoming. Alright. Examine other files. Member list. Receipt acknowledged with no cred transfer. Alright, these other guys are paying me, which is nice. Potential recruits. Yeah, screw Workers United. They're not paying me anymore. Uh, okay, good. Good stuff. Free money. 150 bucks. Easy. Okay, for a second there, like, it... Once you turn off those... Oh, this is a super fancy one. Look at that space out there. Dang. It's pretty nice. This is a fancy hotel. Where's all the money? Oh, when you have a fancy hotel, don't you just have, like, piles of money sitting in bags on your bed or something? Money in your toilet. Oh, his to toilet overfloweth. Ah, he put it under the kitchen sink. That's where I put my money, too. Um, okay. Okay, good. Can I pick up the magazines? No. Hell yeah. I don't even know what I want to do with this money, either. Like... And I guess I should hire another person. I just don't know what uh, what class to hire. I wonder if there's a problem with uh, hiring. I don't. Or no, that's not what I was gonna say. I wonder if there's a problem. Like, if I activate this wall panel, is that gonna cause a problem later down the line or something? Um. Like, it'll actually activate the hundreds of kill bots that they have stored in there. Oh, a luckier charm. On take damage, 20% chance to heal for 50% of the damage. That's really cool. Um, if I go to loadout, I want to give that to Isaac. And maybe we'll give the... Uh, that seems really strong. Give the prototype tech eye to our to Dr. Fassier. That's pretty sweet. Cred sticks. I like this weird forest projection. Really nice. Would recommend to friends. Everybody has their freaking cred sticks in their toilets. It's not that smart, honestly. At least it's consistent. Guess I should finish uh, going through the red. Oh God! Spooked me. Jump scares, man. Uh, yeah, vanish. Me. See, cause he takes aggro, so him like. It's super good. Oh, we can ignite him. For 10 void energy. Deals damage for each shield destroyed 
and for each sto point of stored void energy. He has one shield. Oh, baby. That's really cool. That seems like it could hit really hard if, um... Hit really hard if you, like, built up void energy on one target, and then when you were ready to switch to the second one. Nice. This is getting pretty cool. I'm digging it. I mean, we have the number advantage here, obviously. Got some delicious loot. Good stuff. Yeah, there's another stick in the tree. Oh, a med kit, sweet. Hell yeah. Like, I've just come to expect that there's money in every one of these toilets now. Why should there not be, I guess? Herman, I hate to be a bother, but please do remember that all pets must stay confined, confined to personal quarters and are not allowed to roam free on the deck. Miss Gilhenny reported that Pickles left a rare drop in her slippers again. Nice. Damn it, Pickles. But why don't why doesn't he have if he has a cat, also, where's the cat right now? But, like, wouldn't he have like a cat litter box in his room? Maybe in the in the future space they don't have they have space litter boxes that are invisible or something. Hello. Hello, waiter box. How are you doing? I wonder if it's worth it to ignite him. I mean, it looks cool. And he gets, uh, he's demeaned and taunted. Oh, okay, never mind, that's from Isaac. Nice, good miss on your, like, boosted damage hit. Amazing. Almost ready to level up. Common accessory. It just does nothing. Space turkey foot. It's like a lucky rabbit's foot, but it's a space turkey instead. Nice. Some med kit in the bathroom. That's not soap. Oh my god, the dream. Creds in the toilet and in the under the sink. This is a... Uh, this was a rich room. How do I see the... I hit minus or plus? How do I... No, not quite. How do I uh, adjust my map? map. Uh, okay. I was reading this. Have spotted a bug with the room layout or map? So this game is still in, uh, some sort of alpha or beta or something. Sweet. Romantic poetry. Wait a second. So beautiful it hurts. Nice. Good. Excellent. I don't understand. Maybe this is the litter box right here. <laughs> I don't know. Uh. Oh, man. Why do they have Pokeballs on their ceilings of their bathrooms? Uh, 
We've entered one of the many commercial districts spread across the upper deck. Several security bots and cameras are patrolling the area between you and the elevator. Warning, hostiles here. Plot, direct course to target, avoid fisticuffs. And then Dr. Fassier says, rend their husks and crush their souls, or we slip past, or both. I'm fine with fighting them. I need experience, man. Hello? Let's just beat up this guy. Oh, man. He's got, uh... Oh, dude. Okay. Cop bot and cop bot rookies. Alright, who has the most shields? Cop bot rookies actually have the most shields, but... Top bot has the most health, so we'll start. Uh, we'll we'll vanish on this guy. Oh crap! He is summoning cop bots. We're gonna shadow bolt this guy. You're gonna de well. You're gonna demean this guy. <laughs> Ooh, this is gonna get this is gonna get nasty. I don't have enough void energy, so we need to keep shadow bolting this guy. Oh man, Isaac's gonna start taking some freaking damage. It's okay. throw a cone at zero? That's rude. Stop throwing cones. That's ridiculous. This is silly. Okay, kill this man. Nice. 74 void energy. Okay, I'm ready to annihilate Copbot. We're going to um, start murdering this guy. I don't want to do damage to their shields yet because I want to ignite this guy. Okay, I didn't do all that much damage, all things considered. Oh, Dr. Fassier. Don't do this. cones. That's just so rude. Uh, do you have shields left? Yes. Why don't we ignite you? He just reordered the timeline. All right. Okay, I'm actually going to... We'll just execute this guy. He's gone. And then you can ignite this guy. Bust his shields up. Loses control of his void energy. What does that do? Oh, 18 damage to everything. That's not great. We should probably heal Dr. Fassier, all things considered. One HP, come on! That's okay. Uh. 
No, I mean, you have to kill this guy. Because he, he would have come before any other people. I wanted to use Zero to do, like, a, one of his multi-hit attacks or something. Can you use, um... I don't think you can use HP packs in combat. So that's important. That's good to know. 50 void damage is pretty good. Oh. Okay. Uh, let's go to loadout. We want to use... Right-click to heal this character. Yes. I think everybody else is fine. Can't... Oh, a hidden stash. Someone heard us. Thundering Soldiers Sayama Blasto of Lesser Nanites. Alright. I'm down. Let's uh, let's see if that's good for Isaac. That would be less damage than his currently equipped thing. And less critical hit and more time units and stuff. All right. Hello, cop bot. Okay, let's just uh, let's focus let's focus cop bot. He's just gonna. Oh, I don't want him to summon people. I mean, it's too late now. He's already summoned people. I'm worried about Fassier's health a little bit. Wait, why did we start with 40 void energy this time? Maybe I should ignite all their shields. I don't think that's a, a poor choice, necessarily. Hold on, how much is, uh, 40 void energy? Sixty-three damage, that's what I'm talking about. One more. He just reorganized everybody, but didn't actually, like, do all that much. These are both 125 time units, so we're fine. Isaac is tased. Hold on. 40? Yeah, I need 40. to ignite this guy. Wait, this guy... These guys both have this full health. Yeah. Alright. That's what I'm talking about. This last guy. 
Everybody's shields are down. I like it. Including... Like, literally everybody. Let's, uh, let's vanish here. Um... I mean... You sh you can mean this guy. Zero should be able to kill him next turn. Probably, hopefully. Forty-six damage. I mean, probably. So let's start on the other guy. Oh, good. Got a malfunction. What do we get? Time unit cost decreased by twenty percent. Accuracy decreased by twenty percent. That doesn't seem like it's a very good thing. Alright, but we have done it. Zero leveled up. That's good. Everyone's sort of okay on health, so I think we're fine without using a broken fuel rod, cracked module. Alright, a couple bucks. Let's see if we can get something cool for zero here. Oh, if I do Falling Rain from Stealth, I get additional things. I haven't even been using that. Target's damage by dash have a 10% reduced accuracy for one turn at level 3. Target's damage targets take 5% additional damage for one turn each time they are hit by Falling Rain. Let's do... let's, let's upgrade dash. That seems really good to me. Whenever you damage a target, your damage increases by 3% until the end of turn. So that's good with Falling Rain. Damage enemy has a combo point. Inflict 100% bonus damage. Transfer one combo point to the primary target. Seems pretty okay. I might end up respecking. I, I might try a different tree for him because I, I don't think we have the uh, time units for him or the uh, the points for his tree to really excel quite yet. I don't think. Out for trip wires. Hello. Um. Yes. Let's go, let's, we're gonna stealth and then we'll try dash. So that gets an additional benefit, doesn't it? Uh, start breaking shields. I wonder if he's taunted if he won't summon up. No, never mind. Fair enough. God's chance increased by 20%.
a really cool attack effect. I like it a lot. Okay, you're going to ignite. Like this guy will just work left to right. Did it miss? Oh, it missed. That's so bad. Everybody's missing, though, so... Um... You know what? We want to do more damage. Uh, zero can just falling rain everybody now. Stop throwing cones at me, please. Uh, yeah. So just shadow bolt this man. Then Isaac is going to. That didn't kill him. That's obnoxious. Uh, let's go. It's just like a basic, just dash. There we go. It worked out. We're gonna ignite. Um, why can we ignite this guy? It's ten damage per shield. Or ten void energy per shield. Oh, I just used strike instead of what I wanted to. Dang it. There's a miss. 20% accuracy loss. Hurting. Kill this man. Okay, you're going to ignite this guy because he has four shields. That does a lot of damage to him as well. So this guy doesn't have shields, maybe we should attack him. I mean, I still don't quite understand how shields work. That's okay. We'll ignite this guy. Did that miss? God fucking damn it. Alright, easy combat. We got a Bloom Slang Blasto and a Busted Emojion. Let's, uh, I think we need to. Can you not save in the mission? That really sucks. I guess that means I need to go faster through this. Um, we need to get the black box. Fast combat animations, we've done it. Okay, save changes. Uh, 
uh, carbon. Seems neat. Not totally what, what I want, but that's okay. What is that a pressure plate or something? Okay, this spot. Mall elevator. Let's go. Deck 105. Ignoring that that bot. You didn't ever see me. Zaldin was here. these doors are locked. Except for this one. <laughs> Riggs always called Jablonski an idiot. Hey, nobody calls Jablonski no idiot. Jablonski has the last laugh. Found these med, med, med bots wandering around down here when they where they ain't supposed to be again. Lock them in storage. That'll surprise Riggs next time he sneaks off for another nap. Ha! Jablonski out. Jablonski, you idiot! How many times do I have to tell you if the field catalyzers aren't aligned, they're going to malfunction? You keep locking down the damn nav bay and the navigators are sick of it. Keep doing it and your next short leave will be out the nearest airlock. Why can't we all just get along? Welcome user Jablonski. Auto updates disabled. Lo loading last update. Nav bay alert. Status lockdown. Unstable catalyzer alignment. Please manually reset catalyzer alignment. Okay, we want to unlock, we're going to, hold on, what did he do? Lock them in storage, so we don't want to open storage. We want to unlock the nav bay. Catalyzer control, remain, return to main, we unlock the catalyzer control. 17 days since last workplace accident, alright. We don't want the med bot, we don't want to have to fight the med bots. I don't think. I've already been here, hold on. Security storage, there's like lots of, there's gonna be robots in there. Like possibly loot too, but also I just wanna finish the mission, you know. It's been a freaking hour. Okay, now we got puzzles. Did we do it? Oh, nope. Okay, wait, wait, wait. We're trying to get them all up or all down? Because they're all up. What the heck? That one swaps those two's position. That one puts them all... Oh my god. Need to reset the catalyzers. This is horrible. I hate this. Flush. There we go. Thank you. Okay, reset everything. So this one... Raises this one by one. This one raises that one by two. That one raises these two. So I need to like... No, too much. No, we've, we've gone overboard. Almost had it. Oh no, see, I had it. Okay, hold on, hold on. I just did the wrong one. It's south. No, no. You go west first. Okay, 
west. Then south. And then this one should raise it up. No! Too much. Crap. Everything's exploded. West, then north. North just raises the north one. Okay. So that's the most consistent. We got a... East raises the north one as well, but lowers the east one. South raises those two. This will raise these two. Yeah, I don't want that. So we go... That's wrong. Raise that one. This should be it. We did it. Is it good? We did it. Report to this thing. Unlock nav bay. Please manually reset catalyze. God damn it. You kidding me? Oh no, we did it. It's it's done. We're in the nav bay. This is the, the area. Boom slang, heavy armor. Okay. That might be good for Isaac. Minus 10% health if he equips it. All right, never mind then. Oh, this looks like an ab bay to me, if I've ever seen one. These are such cool terminals. Black box. Robotic voice from the console begins a pre-recorded message. Greeting or greetings, Aurora Starliners employee. Null reference. Would you like to initiate transmission of black box data from the Stella Marine to an authorized third party? Please note that unauthorized transmission of black box data is grounds for immediate termination as punishable by airlock dismissal, as stated in your NDA. Um, shiny coins buy pretty trinkets. Horizon has the coins. Plain economics dictates the obvious choice. Horizon pays well and wins. Duty before credits. Retrieve the black box for Aurora Starliners as ordered. Initiate an emergency transmission. Uh, let's send it to... Workers United. Something broke. Alright. You remove the damaged black box from the console and stash it in your pack. <laughs> oh boy. What do you mean, sort of? Oh, oh, man. Oh. Oh, hello. Crawler, ah ha, thanks for securing the black box there, scrubs. You bumblers cleared a nice path for me. Sure do appreciate it. Ah ha ha, ain't that cl classic. Uh, assault his mind with terror. Gah, get out of my head. Oh, the darkness, fire, snakes, the blue dog. <laughs> Holy shit. Alright. Um, Fido, Evie, and. Hey! Hey! My character's name is Zero First. Oh, Jesus. I don't know about this. Okay. You're gonna demean this man. Uh oh. You missed. Oh, plus damage. That's not good. 
I don't know about this. Dog, dude. They're getting all these crazy buffs. Starts channeling frenzied barking. Oh, God. Okay, why don't we, uh... Break Fido's shields here. We could probably burst down Fido. So many things are happening. Um, yeah, we'll cloud first here. Fido's almost dead. Let's just kill Fido. Or we can dash. Get lucky and kill Fido. Excellent. Holy crap, man. That did so much damage. Why don't we ignite? Eevee doesn't have any shields. Neither does zero. They they don't have any shields, so we'll ignite. Main dude. We'll just focus him. He's almost dead. Zero has fallen in battle. Uh oh. That's not good. Oh god. The dog bots are enraged. Oh good. It's fine. We have plenty of health. Why, Eevee, you're too gigantic. Please don't ever do that to me. That's, I'm, I'm, I'm happy about that. That's totally fine with me. Don't kill Dr. Passier. Why are you going through his shields? There we go. All right, and we've done it. Zero got no experience for that, great. Excellent. We'll take this Rigo's favorite shotgun, heavy shotgun. For this job, you need a shotter gun. I wonder if that's better for anyone. Oh, you beat up old Rigo pretty good. Reckon you'll want to put me out of my misery, eh? We'll get to it. Vital sounds, signs still found, impressive resilience. Pity you are meat. Spare Rigo's life and use a medkit on him. Shadows sing your hour is not yet fly, little bird. Gathers to shake, lurches shakily to his feet and gathers the remains of the dogbots onto the elevator platform. As he descends out of sight, he fixes you with a blood, bloodied smile. Be seeing ya. All right. Don't let them in the eye, they'll never know the box is harmed. Their vision is based on movement. <laughs> Low, I understand that you've secured the black box. Black box is a bust. I imagine you are sad, no pizza party. What do you mean? Are you telling me they damaged the black box after securing it? We, enough, our courier will be awaiting, awaiting your return to sticks. You had, return to sticks. It didn't <laughs> let us scroll or anything. All right, mission's done. They leveled up. Aurora Starliners expressly forbade the transfer of the black box data and is upset by this outcome. Workers United is grateful that you tr transmitted the data to them. Horizon is displeased that you failed to transmit the data to them. Your wired information to Workers United on Workers United to Da Blue. Okay. All right. Well, some shit happened from Workers United. I realized in my haste to get off the ship, I never formally introduced myself. Please excuse me, having to e meet you. Uh, this guy promoted thanks to your help, but there's a chance I can return the favor down the line. Toss some work your way. Okay, great. Here... Uh, we were disappointed in your failure to transmit data as requested. Watch your back. Okay, good. Excellent. Good stuff. I like it. Zero's dead. As, as per usual. Um... We're going to take Aegis mode, which seems pretty neat. 
I like that a lot. And, uh... Dr. Fassier is gonna get... Uh... Can we take a point in Torrent so that I can ha expend Void Energy? We can. I like it. Consume 40 Void Energy. To channel raw energy directly into the target, attacking one time for every 10 points of stored Void Energy. Boost deals 20% weapon damage and boosts damage taken by 1% for 3 turns. Okay. Alright. Cool. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed, hit the like button and subscribe. Uh, I'll see you next time. Bye bye